Hello everyone! Welcome back po sa channel natin. Text Nation po ang pangalan ng channel ko. So, this is Greg Shorthand Tutorial Part 28. So, before we move on, magkaroon po tayo ng review. Let's have a review of our lesson last time. So, last time we took up only one principle that is word ending there, which is represented by either over it or under it. So, we have here some examples. U, E there for weather, A, N, U there for another, B, R, U there for brother, B, O there for brother, F, A there for father, U there, other, U there, S, others, E there, either, R, A there, rather. So we read it again. We have weather, another, brother, brother, father, other, others either and rather so again word ending there is represented by either over it or under it dependent on the facility of writing form so we have here some sentence examples so you have first my brother is my best friend period i need praise po yan i need another cup of coffee period my mother is bothered. So, RD blend. My mother is bothered by the weather these days. Period. So, these days po. Uh, over it, ES, that's this, and DAS. Balik ka rin po ang A kasi you facilitate writing the S sound. Okay? So, yan po ang konting example applying word ending there. Now, we move on to the new lesson, which is word ending meant. Word ending meant, guys, is represented only by M. Yan po ang meant. So, we have here examples like moment. Take note ending, ha? Kaya katapusan. Element. We have element. Bakit may RE? Kasi ang root word niya is element. So, considered siya as ending. Payment. Settlement. Okay. We have here complement and complement. Magkaiba po siya. So, complement, you complete something and you complement, you praise. Okay, so that's two different words with the same sounds. So, we have here engagement, word ending meant, and we have here word beginning N, which is represented only by N because it's followed by the consonant sound of gay. And then we have movement and commitment. Okay, so we write the outlines. We have here M O M, -E -N, that is moment. E L E M -E -N, for element. Dagdagan lang po ng R E for elementary. We have P A M -E N, na sa labas po. Circles are written outside angles, so you facilitate writing the M. S E T L, that settle and M -E -N, for settlement. Com represented only by K because it's followed by the consonant sound P. P, L, E, M, that's complement. Pag may complementary, you just add R, E. Pag complement, you just add O, S. So, the same po ang outline ng dalawa. Then, we have N that's represented by uh, the consonant sound or the sound of N. G, A, J, M, for engagement. We have M, U, V, M for movement. And dito natin yung sulat ang commitment kasi kulang tayo ng space. So, K, M. Bakit siya K, M? Because the sound is that follows is E. That is a vowel sound, E. So, you represent K, COM by K, M by spelling it out. So, commitment. Okay? So, again, word ending meant is represented only by M. So, we have moment, element. Elementary, payment, settlement, engagement, movement, and commitment. Plus other examples that you can form po using the uh, the sound of men provided its word ending. Iba po ang word beginning. Okay? Okay guys, I have written here some sentences. So, S-E-N, ten, and says, that's sentences. Uh, examples so uh, involving the use of word ending man so we have here number one emma and mike's engagement 
maybe one of the. Take note, this is one of the. Siguro di pa natin ito na take, pero one of the po yan. We omit the sound of O in between one and the. So, one of the happiest, S-A-P-E-S-T, happiest moments in their lives, period. Emma and Mike's engagement may be one of the happiest moments in their lives, period. We, so we have U-E, that's we and E-D, that's we need, T-U-G-E-T, to get. We need to get the commitment of all members of the team, period. My elementary teacher, comma, Mrs. Lopez, comma, will receive the payment, payment, for the services of teaching Dennis how to read and write, period. Okay, so these are some examples, guys. Applying word ending math.